Piper Local Weather Service. This is your Northcast weather update. As a medical director, I work closely with all our providers as well as the nursing staff to ensure we provide top-notch quality care for all our residents. Seeing every resident achieving their goal and being satisfied with our care gives me a lot of pride to be part of the team of preferred care at Epsecon. Hi everybody, happy Tuesday. I hope you got to enjoy our beautiful afternoon. We're gonna be seeing a nice quiet night ahead. It's that time of year where after dinner, you just wanna go sit outside for a little bit, whether you got a fire pit, a back deck, a patio, whatever you have, you just wanna go outside and enjoy that nice refreshing evening air. Temperatures dropping down into the 70s pretty quickly, right before and then after sunset. Tomorrow, if you wanted to sit by the pool, that's a great idea. Lots of sunshine out there, not too many clouds, and maybe you're trying to get a tan. You don't have to worry about uh, the clouds drifting by too much. It's just going to be bright and sunny and, again, pretty comfortable. Temperatures will be in the 70s down the shore, 80 further inland. Uh, speaking of down the shore, next couple of days are going to be winters as well. Lots of sunshine out there and really not much in the way of rain chances, but also not much in the way of humidity. We're still very comfortable for the next few days. Today we have those dew points kind of in the mid-50s for most spots. They're going to climb a little bit day after day, but I would say not until about Friday or Saturday do we feel kind of sticky and humid once again. Once we see that extra moisture move in, we're also going to be seeing a chance for some scattered showers, uh, not washouts. Each day is still going to have a whole lot of sunshine out there. We're just going to see between a little bit of moisture and approaching warm front, a quick little chance for some scattered showers. High pressure for tomorrow and even Thursday, but it's on Friday that we start to deal with our next approaching little warm front. That's going to act as a trigger, kind of cause some of those scattered showers, but again, most of each day still looks dry and very comfortable. We have Tropical Storm Ernesto, Ernesto uh, moving west-northwest at 24 miles an hour. It's got wind speeds of 50 miles an hour right now. It's going to continue to organize and strengthen going to keep track into the west heading towards Puerto Rico and then by the end of the week it's going to become a category one hurricane that then turns up to the north category two strength before it heads up towards Bermuda and then by the end of the weekend it'll be sitting kind of offshore we're going to see probably some rough surf over the weekend thanks to Ernesto but it should be continuing to kind of head a little bit more towards the east as we look forward to the start of next week so no direct impacts are still expected looking at that 70 forecast a beautiful stretch of weather, lots of sunshine on the way, temperatures staying uh, nice and mild, and again, the dew points don't really pick up until the end of the week. Okay, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your evening. I'll check back in with you later on tonight with your bedtime forecast.